This ghost lets us, this machine lets us turn the ghost you catch into paintings. Not only that, but it works in reverse, too. Hmm, how do we use it, you ask? Well, it's simple. Just plug that Poltergust 3000 into the slot and enjoy the ride, my boy. Like this. So that's right, it's time to turn all these ghosts back to paintings from which they came. As you can see, it only shows the three unique ones, not the generic ones I caught. No one cares about those generic ones. Those ghosts are invisible, so we need to pound the fuck out of them and then shock them. Press them into visible forms. And presto, turn them into beautiful ghost portraits. There was the baby. There's the, the father. And there's the mother. Done. Hmm. Well, we managed to turn those ghosts back into paintings. Thanks for your help, Luigi. Now, in area one, you've caught Neville, Lydia, and Chauncey. Okay. That's a total of three ghosts. All right. That's how much that's worth. How much that's worth. And I don't have any, you know, any of that other stuff. I have some pearls, which are worth three million. So my total comes out to about 4.4 million. 4.5 if you want to round up. So now let's save. I'm up to area two. I'll go right back to the mansion. Now here's where things start to get a little bit more complicated for the mansion. <coughs> Very nice. I beat uh, area two in a... Uh, Area 1 in about two video parts. So, now that you're back in the foyer, you just approach this, and the magic of your key will actually remove the lock. Unlock it. Now you'll end up in this dark, ominous hallway. Now, I'll actually show you something spectacular. Oh, wait. Ghosts are going to be hanging from the ceiling, by the way. Not those kind. Those are just normal bats. But there should be, in this hallway... Somewhere. Yeah, they, they do that. There's another one down this hallway, I believe. Yeah, that one's job is just to drop a bomb. It has no health. There should be somewhere in this hallway. I guess he doesn't appear yet. Never mind. I was wrong. He doesn't appear yet. You'll see him later. You actually have to uh, catch him. He leads the way to the first secret room. So, um, yeah, you're supposed to go into... Which door? The bathroom, maybe? I think so. Yeah, I thought it was this door. You need a key for this one. Yeah, this is why this game makes me petrified of mansions now. This and Resident Evil know how to instill the fear of God into me about mansions. Oh, these ghosts are special. Watch. You'll see if one of them gets me. Nope. But he's going to call me about it anyway. I was able to avoid it. Hey, it looks like you ran, uh, you've run into a bit of trouble here. Maybe you need more training. There are some ghosts who will try to grab and hold on to you. When that happens, try moving the control stick back and forth to shake them off. It's an age-old struggle for survival, my boy. Don't lose heart, Luigi. Yeah, so what those ghosts will do is they'll wrap around you and constrict you so you can't move. But I was able to prevent that. Alright, and yeah, that unlocks that door. I knew I had to go to that door. Oh, here's an interesting little thing you should know. If you go into look at a mirror and select search, you'll be teleported back to the front of the mansion. Anywhere in the from anywhere in the mansion that has a mirror, if you search it, you'll be teleported. It's pretty helpful when you need you know you need to get back somewhere and save, and maybe heal up, search for health.
Wah 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 wah. Do 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 do. Hold on a sec. Let me very briefly put my fan in position. Also, it lets me know that what time it is. <laughs> now these ghosts are special as well. You see how they have masks? You need to vacuum off their masks first before you can do anything to them. The masks cover their faces. So obviously you can't va you can't flash them if they're uh if they have masks on. They also are, are reminiscent of the shy guys from Mario. Two of them. And done. Now this is where the real fight starts, I believe. Yep. These two are the dancing pair. So now what you're supposed to do is stay on one their rotating disc. And eventually, if you don't clip through them, while they're dancing. He'll say I and expose his heart. They both share a heart, by the way, just so you know. Got him. Yeah, he'll eventually say I and then show his heart. And then you can vacuum them both. But as you can see, I took care of that problem nicely. Yep, so see, this is a blue room. My bad. The rooms are color-coded. I, I, I must be confusing this with another game. Anything green is... Eh, I'm hesitant to say Area 1. I think it's more like Area 4. Because I know this. there's rooms down here you can't complete until Area 4. And that little tiny room up there off that hallway is also area four, so I'm hesitant to immediately dismiss it as area four when it might not actually be area four. Now, hold on, let me quick briefly fix something. Yep. An empty storage room. As you can see, there's a button on the back wall, but I think you need to turn the power on in the room first by getting rid of these guys. You're red! They're red! Hello. Oh shit, here comes a grabber. Get away from me! <laughs> oh, there was a special ghost, but I let him get away because I was... Oh, that sucks. Uh, so as you can see, there's a button in the back. You're supposed to push it. You can't see it from your angle because of the way the camera is. And it reveals an entire segment of the room that you haven't uh, explored yet. So as you can see, danger. There's a picture of a ghost behind some bars. But, you know, knowing Luigi, this is why he isn't the face of gaming. He'll push the button. <laughs> Who's there? Who dares disturb our sleep? Oh, oh, it's Luigi. Look, guys, Luigi's finally here. We're gonna do to you what we did to your brother, only worse. What's that on his back? It's Egad's Poltergust 3000. Everyone scram. And that, yes, that one right there is King Boo in his first appearance. Oh. Ah, do, 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 do. Luigi, are you okay? That was them. Those were the ones who released all of the ghosts from the paintings of my gallery. Those fiends. I wonder where King Boo and his gang had gone. So they were hiding in the mansion all along. Thanks for flushing them out, Luigi. I'm tickled you found them, but perhaps it would have been better if you hadn't. Well, let every single one escape. Just a thought. Ah, well, water under the bridge. Anyway, you should probably come back to the lab for a sec. Alright. Sure. I've been waiting for you, young Luigi. Your brother must have been taken by that gang of booze. Poor feller. 
<laughs> no, no, don't talk crazy. They're not gonna eat the man. But what became of him? Odd that he hasn't come back. Common theory holds that boos grow in strength when they travel in numbers. They must somehow combine their powers too. Their power likely overwhelms your brother. If your aim is to save Mario, there's but only one way to do it: capture each boo and slowly weaken the group's power. But boos, as their name implies, like to hide and then jump out to scare people. You've got your work cut out finding them. <laughs> Don't get all down in the mouth, boy. The Game Boy Horror I gave you has a secret function. I knew it would come in handy one day, so I developed it secretly. I call it the Boo Radar. The Boo Radar will flash red when something round like a boo is hiding nearby. You just search everywhere, Luigi. All right now, Sonny, don't go tuckering yourself out. Relax and just try to get those boos one at a time. The trick is using the control stick and the C stick together. Don't forget now. Where will you go, Luigi? Back to the mansion. All right, so as you can see now, there's a yellow, uh, yellow. There's a light now on my Game Boy Horror. And now what you basically have to do is, well, for right now at least, you're supposed to capture five boos, and then he'll he'll tell you to take a break, and that'll allow you to progress. So as you can see, I entered a room, and now my li my light is flashing yellow, which means there's a boo somewhere in this room. And as you can see, as I move closer to a round object, it turns red, and you keep vacuuming until you see that blue light, and there is the boo. I am bamboo, if you please. These guys are different. You don't actually lock onto them. You just sort of suck them until they stop. So, I, mercy, you've already caught your first boo. I've been researching those guys. Well, boos don't seem to like the light much, that's for sure. They do their best to hide in and under furniture when they're stuck in a lit room. So I reckon that means that turning on all the lights in the mansion is the fastest way to find all the boos. Wouldn't you say, youngster? All right, now send me the boo and all the data you've got. And yes, you can save after every boo. So yeah, there's only usually one boo in a room, but boos can actually run through walls if you're not quickly uh, quick enough to catch them. And it's really hard to catch some of the later ones on your first try. So obviously he's hiding in one of these pots. Got him. Looking for me, Buddha? Buddha! Liquid! What the shit? Yo, he's like stuck in between the rooms. Alright, as long as you immediately chase them, they won't have a chance to hide again. So as you can see, they, they get glitched sometimes between the rooms. Fantastic, way to go, Luigi. Now send me the boo and all the data you've got. Alright, good. Be careful, Luigi. Let's move on. The Anta room. So yes, there's also going to be a boo in here. I just walked in and was flashing like a madman. Found him. Do you want to play some Game Boo Advance? Yeah, see, I knew it. Some Game Boo Horror. You're on fire, Luigi. on fire. Now send me the boo you've got. Alright, I don't need to save after every boo. I'm not that, you know, I'm not going to die that quickly that I need to I need to save after every single boo. So, all right, I caught three of 50 boos. So, basically, you go back to every room you've so far explored. Ah, this room is lit now. Sweet. So, for example, in here, there's going to be a boo. Money. And the boo. Speak not my name, taboo. Yeah, they all say this witty quote. It's pretty funny sometimes. Speak not my name, taboo. All right, I'll save after that one. That was a good one. Got the money. Those fake doors will still get you, by the way. Just saying. Here, is she, here it is. I'm the yummy bullicious. Nope, no escape. Alright, now he'll probably tell me to move on to the next area. 